official name. percussionist has been a musician all his life, except when he was playing Atari, or seeing to the demise of his enemies, or the demise of cats. He was so noisy, as a baby, his parents left him on a street corner. His mother did not, in fact, hatch him from an alien egg, but wanted to name him and his father hoped he would grow up to be a <laughs> evil as fuck from the very beginning as you can tell by the photographic evidence of him being a demon pure evil pure doom But on the sixth day of the sixth month of the sixth year, he rode his bike to the courthouse, assumingly with really loud clackers in his bicycle spokes, and he threatened the judge with a drum solo, swore an oath on an upside down Bible, then declared his name with the power of the moon as a gigantic speaker. I am Spike the Percussionist. He wasn't allowed to touch his older brother's records, so he got a drum set. Favorite color is what? His favorite color is what? No! It In fact, 
He has a vast collection of doom sounding instruments. Doom colored clothes. Doom flavored foods. Doom scented potpourri. And doom in every room. Usually, these kind of photo memory lane things are for funerals. Spike is not dead, but he is 50 years old. Oh, and what the hell is up with the tongue? Always with the tongue. Depending on the context, it means teasing, flirting, disliking, being silly, angry, rude, rebellious, or evil. In Maori people of New Zealand, sticking the tongue out was part of the war chant to intimidate the enemy with fierceness and strength. On occasion in Arab nations, it is seen as a triumphal lolling of the tongue. In Tibet, it is a sign of respect. In China, it is a sign of embarrassment, but also in Ayurvedic and Chinese medicine, the tongue is considered a map to the current state of health, changing in appearance as the health changes. Sticking your tongue out in the West is a sign of disrespect. England's coat of arms, the lion and the unicorn both stick out their tongues because the English are dicks. Famous tongue sticker outers include Medusa, Kali, the goddess of destruction, Albert Einstein, Mick Jagger allegedly being heavily involved in the occult. Gene Simmons of KISS is a clear example of rebellion and demonic celebration. Other tongues can be seen in Masonic and occult symbols, deities or masks, and gargoyles believed to protect the buildings from other spiritual powers. Mm -hmm.